Yep, that's me. Today, I try Marine Corps martial arts. We're here, Camp Pendleton. Just went through our O course. We did some Marine Corps martial arts training earlier. Now they're running us through this obstacle course. At the end, they have a martial arts or a McMap station set up for us. So we're gonna have to demonstrate what we learned this morning to utilize on the instructors. My name is Sergeant Thaken, and today we're gonna to be going over the shoulder throw. The shoulder throw is in the green belt syllabus. Now, before I can do anything, right now what you're in is your demonstration position. Can everybody say demonstration position? Demonstration position. Okay, now what I need you to do right now is go ahead, stand up, partner with somebody of equal height and equal weight. Please do that. The purpose of this technique is to take your opponents to the deck and de-escalate the situation. Does everybody understand that? Yes. yes. All right, next I have my principles. Now my principles is BBLT. Body position, balance, leverage, and timing. Body position. Body position, you want to ensure that your body is properly positioned so that way you can actually execute the technique. Does everybody understand that? Balance. You want to ensure that you have proper weight distribution throughout your body so that way when you actually execute this technique, you are not disrupting your own center of gravity. Does everybody understand that? Yeah. Leverage. You will use your opponent as a lever to take them off of the ground, up in the air, and back onto the ground. Does everybody understand that? Fundamentals. Fundamentals. We have entry off balance, execution, and angles of movement. Does everybody understand that? Yes. Entry. Entry is me actually invading my opponent's center of uh, personal space. Does everybody understand? Yes. Off balance is me disrupting my opponent's center of gravity. Does everybody understand that? Yes. Execution is me bringing all of them together and taking him to the deck. And last but not least, I said angles of movement, and that's me actually executing that angle of movement to, get, to disrupt my opponent's center of gravity, to take them to the deck. Everybody tracking? Now, foot. That foot needs to be close to the other foot. And bring your hips out as much as possible. Make sure. So, this foot's still staying beside yes. this one? And bring your hips out. Now, lift them up. Oh, that's it. Yeah, that's, that's it. it. What they're doing right now is they're warming up. So they're basically doing something to get the heart rate up so they can initiate the Marine Corps martial arts that they perform at the end. So what I've been doing, I've been running this course all day. I went through a series of instruction earlier and when we get to the end, I'm gonna get to throw somebody and hopefully they're gonna throw me. Action! I didn't know what to do your job. Let's go work! Action. Woo! 
Wait! Thank you. Mm -hmm. Always bleeding somewhere. Always okay. bleeding somewhere. Oh. It's all good. Man, when I was on the mats with Jocko, I was gushing blood. So, that was fun. First thing we need to understand is that there's no such thing as first place, second place, and third place when we talk about this warrior mindset. It's either you live or you die. It's either yes or no. It's either you impose your will or you submit to theirs. So when we talk about that physical discipline, what I need you to understand is as you embark on your training that this is no personal gain here. That you will break your body down and use those pieces to put yourself back together because every time that you face your, your adversity that will take human form, you will have to strike it with the metric force of a ton. I need you to understand. Here with my boy Staff Sergeant Yippis. You've probably seen him in my other videos, but he's going to explain a little bit more about what McMap is and why it's important to be trained towards McMap. All right, what's up, guys? So you've seen me before. I'm over here with this motivator. Um, so McMap is going to be pretty much the martial arts for the Marine Corps. All right. So a lot of you guys have seen jiu-jitsu, boxing, uh, you name it. The difference between McMap and the rest of these sports is that our art is for combat all right any my uh, one mine any weapon makes sense so we're very proficient it doesn't matter whether it's a rock whether it's a stick we are going to utilize any weapon around us to defeat the enemy and uh get it gain the tactical advantage all right so pretty much um the reason why we're here today is because my brother um decided that he wanted to learn a little bit about my passion which is the martial arts program so we kind of took him through a whole course on how we do business as far as uh, the bell system um we are very passionate about this program especially myself it's definitely never given it's always earned um and it has to do with the three disciplines so we preach about physical character and mental and that's why McMap is so important. It doesn't matter how lethal you are. It doesn't matter if you're a stud. If you don't have the three disciplines, then you're no good to us. And what we mean is you have to be physically fit in order for you to freaking be lethal whenever you're in these combat scenarios. You have to have the character because at the end of the day, uh, that's what separates Marines from everybody else. We're not killers. We're protectors of life. All right. So you need to have that good character. Are you going to be a problem everywhere that you go or are you going to be a solution? Is, is the room a little bit safer because you're there all right and then the mental portion is extremely extremely important because we as you guys know you're going to hit that barrier on the physical aspect or there's going to be those choices where people are going to tell you to drink and get in a vehicle and drive but that's where that mental comes in as far as uh, you combine all of it with the character making that right decision so that everybody else around you it's a little bit safer because you are there so kind of like in a nutshell that's what uh mcmap is about it's about us making sure that we are lethal whenever we go to combat or whenever we're out here in the civilian factor making sure that all of those around us are a little bit safer because we are properly trained the right way appreciate it so guys i appreciate y'all watching hopefully you learned something today about the mcmap program uh, it was definitely new for me because in the Navy, being in my rate, we, we study and we train for MOG moves, which are mechanical advantage control holds, which is nothing even compared to McMath. So I really enjoyed this program. I appreciate you bringing me out here today. And I will see you guys in the next video.